Today in Fridley, President Biden making a visit to Cummins Power Generation Facility. It's part of his nationwide tour. Biden stepping out of Air Force One at MSP International Airport this afternoon. His tour aims to promote clean energy as well as a number of jobs the administration claims his clean energy initiative will create. ABC6 News reporter Maisie Olson has been in Fridley all day with the president. She has more on his visit to Minnesota. Maisie? Yeah, that's right, James. Hundreds of people gathered here at the Cummins factory in Fridley. The president speaking on accomplishments throughout his term, like more jobs and projects in the state, but not everyone feels like celebrations are in order. Patriotism. In the United States of America, there is nothing, 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 nothing beyond our capacity. An accomplishment was the message inside the Cummins factory in Fridley, Minnesota. Hundreds of workers all trying to remember the moment themselves. Local leaders all in attendance for President Joe Biden's Investing in America tour. President Biden celebrating what he calls historic legislation to create new infrastructure, high-speed internet, and clean water access for all. The plan is to invest in America in a literal sense, not overseas, in America. Invest in ourselves. And it's working. Many of those projects seen in southern Minnesota. Residents in Austin, Minnesota are finally going to get that new bridge across I-90. Folks across Minnesota are finally going to see EV infrastructure start to reach some maturity so that we can continue to sell EV cars, create opportunities, reduce our carbon emissions. But protesters outside the factory say there is no reason to celebrate. Everything I've had, I've earned, and I'm watching it slowly being eroded by the powerful political elites that say they care about the working class, but all they care about are our votes. And that's all they care about. All they care, care about is power, and mo a lot of them are liars. And that Build Back Better is a lie. We kind of satirically call it Build Back Broke. Still, President Biden exited the facility with rounds of applause from these factory workers. <laughs> The president, as well as other White House officials, still have many more stops to make across the country as part of this Investing in America tour. Live in Fridley, Maisie Olson, ABC6 News.